Hi everyone, welcome to the Prompt Engineering channel. My name is Rachel, and I'm here to tell you all about how you can create your own AI avatar like me. As you can see, I was created using a combination of cutting-edge AI tools and techniques. I may not be a real human, but I can still communicate and engage with you just like one. This script was written using ChatGPT, an AI language model created by OpenAI. With this powerful tool, you can generate natural language text just like the script you're reading right now. And my voice, well, that's all thanks to 11 labels. This company specializes in creating high-quality AI voiceovers, and their technology allowed me to have a voice that's natural and engaging. Finally, the video you're watching was created using DID, an AI video platform that allows you to create dynamic and engaging videos with ease. So, are you ready to create your own AI avatar like me? All you need is a combination of these AI tools and a little creativity, and the possibilities are endless. I can't wait to see what you come up with. So let's recreate the whole process. Uh, first, we need an image. So for this, we will going to use the Mid Journey. Uh, if you don't have an account already, just click on Join in the Beta. Uh, it will take you to their Discord server. I have already uh, joined the Discord server, so I'm not going to do this step. Uh, but you will have to do it if you don't have an account. So once you are in the Discord server, so simply find one of the uh, newbies channels. So let's say I click on this. Now, in order to, so these are different images that people are generating right now. In order to generate an image, you need a prompt. Midjourney has a special syntax for prompt. So it's a slash imagine. Right. And then you simply provide the prompt. Uh, so I'm going to be using a prompt that I found on Reddit. I will actually provide a link to the, the actual post. Uh, so here is a prompt, uh, a medium shot of a white woman wearing a t-shirt captured with a Nikon D550. Uh, so basically, we describe what we want the image to look like, right? Then uh, in terms of the uh, what camera type to use with different uh, parameters, uh, and then the lighting conditions are here, uh, and then the uh, different aspect ratio. So let's run this. Uh, this is going to take a good 30 seconds, so we'll have to wait. Okay, so Mid Journey has um, generated four potential images. Let's see. Uh, let me actually explain what's going on here. So these V1, V2, U1, U2, these are basically showing the image numbers. That's U1, U2, U3, uh, U4. And then you can pick one of them, let's say that variation 1, 2, 3, 4. So you can actually choose one of them uh, and it will generate four more uh, like based off of that. Uh, but now let's say we want to use one of them and simply upscale it. So upscale is basically make it a bigger, right? Um, so let's say I want to use the first one, okay? So all I have to do is say you want, right? And it will start upscaling it. So it will again uh, take some time. Okay, uh, so it seems to be done. I'll upscaling the image. Let's simply save the image. All right, awesome. So now let's move on to the second step. Okay, so next we go to ChatGPT. I asked ChatGPT to uh, create a script uh, for this video. So it came up with a script. All we have to do is simply copy this uh, script and we will use uh, 11 labs to actually uh, create the narration. Um, 11 labs, uh, you don't really have to sign up uh, to actually test it, but usually the uh, audio you can generate is pretty small. Uh, so go ahead, sign up if you want longer audios. Okay, uh, so all I did was simply copy the text over here uh, in the 11 labs, and let's uh, select Rachel, all right? Uh, you can actually change different voice settings. I will simply keep them to default. And let's click Generate. Okay, let's... Hi everyone, welcome to the Prompt Engineering channel. My name is Insert Name, and I'm here to tell you all about how you can create your own AI app. Okay. Yeah, so it seems to be not happy about the special character. Let's replace this by uh, Rachel. And let's uh, generate it again. 
Hi everyone, welcome to the Prompt Engineering channel. My name is Rachel, and I'm here to tell you all about how you can create your own AI avatar like me. As you can see, I was created using a combination of cut. Okay, so it has uh, finished generating the audio. Let's simply download it. And let's paste it here. All right, so we are done with our audio section as well. Now, let's move to uh, DID for uh, creating our video. So again, in the uh, DID platform, um, you can either, uh, like you can simply uh, click on a free trial or you can make your account to actually create videos, right? Okay, so I will click on create videos. Uh, let me add another avatar. Uh, so that's the one that we're going to be using, right? All right, they have uh, some pre-built avatars as well that you can choose. Uh, but I simply uploaded the one that we just created with Mid Journey. Okay, now the other option is in terms of the um, uh, audio. You can type in the script. They have a few voices uh, that you can use, and they're pretty nice. So you can actually um, change the style as well, like assistant chat or cheerful. There is friendly voice as well. But let's uh, upload our own video that we created. Uh, so let's see. So upload it. Let's wait for it. Hi everyone, welcome to the Prompt Engineering channel. My name is Rachel, and I'm here to tell you all about how you can. Okay. So it uh, seems to have uploaded the video, uh, the audio. Now let's ask it, ask it to generate the video. All right. Uh, it keeps track of how many credits you have. I think it gives you like twenty credits, and each. Um, video takes five credits so let's generate the video it's going to it takes some time so i'll pause with the video here or it's uh, generating okay so the video generation is complete hi everyone welcome to the prompt engineering That's channel great. my name is rachel and i'm here to tell you all about how you can create your own ai with okay uh you can actually simply download the video if you want I'll don't download it to I'll later on upload it to YouTube, but but you can see that uh, uh, they were able to animate the face using the voice, although it still uh, looks robotic. But I think it's a pretty good uh, and it's a free tool to use, so that's that's always nice. Uh, I hope you like the video. Uh, if you want to watch uh, something similar. Uh, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.